guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to episode 7 of my next life as a villainous. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> what was that sound like? Oh my god. <laughs> Here comes my dog. <laughs> I didn't call you, Cody. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. oh, Come here. You can lick my hand. No, don't, don't, don't scratch my thigh. Lick my hand. Yes, she's fine. Are you okay, though? Huh? Oh, okay. That makes sense. I'm like, hold up. Mm, you want some drugs, honey? Dog. Go play. Go play with mom. I'm sorry. Hey. Oh. <laughs> so you got in, right? Of course. And then you get the toma gang, and then dead. But you won't see for tomorrow. Everything comes to an event eventually. It's interesting that we're getting maybe not a whole episode about her, maybe half of an episode about her. 
different. I would like it to be a whole episode year round. I didn't want to cry, and I'm not going to cry. Bookworm makes me even cry too much, and I didn't even watch that yet. Oh, ho, ho. Oh. Oh, are you serious? Oh my god. I had a feeling. I had a feeling, but I never... Mm. Mm -mm, no, it's interesting. That too. Don't we all? You're right about that. <laughs> Maria is in love with someone. It's just not who you think it Pretty. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be okay. Mm. Uh
I hope nothing from silence scares you. Don't press that. Feeling. Anybody got fire magic? Oh my god, girl. <laughs> hmm? Okay, now hold on. Should we touch this thing? Uh, it's too late. Mary took a great little hand on it. It's okay. Just got to be more careful. Well, it's a 50 50 either whether you go right or left. Maybe you guys should split up and then try to meet back up together. Well, let's not go west. How about we, you know, we agree to disagree and just go east? What if this is the wrong way? <laughs> Not with that thing in there. Are you parting it like the? Oh my God! He is. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> it would have been hilarious if he did. <laughs>
don't no don't mm, mm, uh, too late. Yeah, I love Katarina. Right, I mean, but hold on. This is Katarina we're talking about. I mean, it was bound to fucking happen. And <sighs> playing, looking for food. I thought she was playing a game. There's that Ronco. You're gonna pick up her voice using okay. Using wind magic. I thought I'd never see the day, but okay. Exactly what it means, mushrooms. <laughs> really? Really? <laughs> huh? But see, I don't know about the mushrooms. I mean, number one, they're purple. And usually when you think of purple, you think of poisonous. Come on, like think of Mario Party. Think of Mario in general. Poison mushrooms, a.k.a. purple mushrooms. So, mm -mm. <laughs> So that dream was just like a premonition for her no matter what because she could have possibly died right there.
Sofia. I still think that is a friend, though. It has to be. Just the connection these two have. It's so obvious. No, I thought that had to be your brother. Or that dark figure right there. Mm. I thought it was just something that she could use to just cut the mushrooms. <laughs> yeah. This is the type of girl who is like, I'm hungry first, and then exam is like the third or fourth thing on her mind. Yeah, you saw that too. Gosh, the mushrooms. Did you fucking see that? That color might be poisonous. Purple. Poisonous. Mm-mm. See, I'm, not, I'm a person who don't like mushrooms like that. I've had portobello mushrooms. Uh, we used it. I don't. We, we use it like something, something like vegetarian ish. Everything else was good, but like a mushroom, I didn't like. Typically, mushrooms don't really have no taste. Just how like a lot of people think uh, avocado is not good because it has no taste, and avocado is actually good as fact. It's really, really yummy, especially when you make a good bomb ass guacamole. But the fact is that Maria has seen this dark shadow. I mean, I don't know what it means. It could possibly be with the mushrooms, maybe, you know? At the end of the day, don't eat the mushrooms. I'm just saying. Don't eat them. Like I said, Mario. Purple. Poisonous. Mm -mm. The fact that her fiancé was like, hey, that color might be poisonous. If it was me, I'd just be like, oh, okay, poisonous, throw them out. <laughs> go get your grade on your exam and then go chill out and maybe, I don't know, go bake something or some, ish, some cookies or a sandwich. Why would I want to bake it? Well, yeah, you could bake a sandwich in a way. I mean, you just putting it in there and just make it nice and hard. So see how much, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm probably making you guys hungry. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I mean... It's interesting that Sophia, out of all the characters, Sophia was the one who had the dream. So I'm still going to keep that in mind that Sophia is her friend, reincarnated, maybe her friend. I don't want to say killed herself, but I feel like something also could have happened to her friend, to Katarina's friend before something, before, well, not, but not before she perished, after she perished, and then they met each other again in the game. And it'd just be so sweet. I mean, honestly, because. What else could it be? I can't really think of anything else because why, number one, she would have that dream because you would automatically assume that she is her best friend that she met before she passed away. And then two, I mean, yes, it's it was a premonition to save Katarina because it literally did the same thing. It was giving her the warning signs. Typically, like most premonitions, where it feels deja vu-esque and everything. And the fact is that Katarina almost to her death and out of all the people who came to her rescue it was Sophia so I don't know it's like you, you put two and two together and still it's a lot of unanswered questions I mean this is only really episode seven you still got this black mist thing or darkness whatever the frick that is and I want to know about that maybe I mean it's a sign for Sophia I don't know but I would if they wanted to and I think they should do this if, like, let's say next week's episode or the following week's episode leading up to the finale does have another dream as for Sophia to, like, kind of honestly really indicate that Sophia is her, then, you know, I ain't mad at it. They can do whatever the heck they want. I mean, this show is technically already done because they've done 
be literally everything for this. And so as a anime reactor or really a watcher and at the same time too, you're just trying to really guess to see how everything goes. But honestly, I ain't gonna know until next Saturday. But other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episode seven of my next life as a villainess. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially on next Saturday for episode eight. Bye, guys.